Welcome to Mayor and Maseki. Next time. This is a system unit, and we are going to disassemble it piece by piece. But the disassembly team will be the one to disassemble it. Let's meet. Good day, everyone. My name is Robert Carriano Camilla. And I'm Lucas Nesmeyer. We are going to disassemble the system unit. The first thing to do is get a Phillips screwdriver and unscrew the screws. After removing the screws, gently remove the cover. This is what's inside of the system unit. Remove the wire gently. Then place the cover in a gentle place. Then put the system unit down. This is what's inside of the system unit. Next, remove the ribbon cable gently and place it in a sheet of foil to prevent any damage. Next, get a screwdriver and unscrew the screws of the motherboard. Then, put the screws in a safe place that it won't be lost. After that, remove the fan and some wires. Put it in a safe place, then remove the power supply. Put it next to the other parts of the system unit. Then remove the motherboard. Now this is a system unit after disassembling everything, and now we have to assemble everything back. Let us meet the assembly team. Hi, today I am Marie Pinagrania, and we are from the Abbey, and we are going to assemble the system unit. First thing to do on assembling it back is putting the motherboard back. Then, putting back the power supply. Assemble it. screws back and assemble the black box. Then, fix everything up on the motherboard. Assemble back the ribbon cable. After putting everything back, slowly stand the system unit. First, before putting back the cover, put back the wire that connects it to the cover. Then slowly, put back the cover. Then assemble it back by using screws. 